against me, man. What you said? I said, what do you have against me? Yeah, why are you, are you even in this class or what? Yeah, why? Because you, you look come big, you can't even lift that five pound weight. Help yourself by getting out of this class. Oh, why, man? Why are you humbug in this class? This class is so cruel. Well, it's cruel until you came. Wait, that's not what the teacher said. Bro, I'm just like pulling your fish into that wall right there. Why? We're friends, though. Bro, we would never be friends. takes up too much room and he makes like he know what to do but he only wastes our time in that class. So Jake, do you know here in school is a bully free zone, right? No. You don't know that? No. Everyone's here in school to learn not to be bullied? scared or bullied. So I think maybe we should call. What? The police? No, your dad. Oh. Have your dad come in and we can talk about it. Hello, Mr. Daniels. This is the vice principal at school. I was wondering if you could come in and talk with me and Jake. Yes. Yes, there's a situation where Jake's been bullying other people. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. He'll be here in a few minutes. So, okay. As we wait, I'm going to call security to come and bring you over. Okay. All right. Two to four. Four. Can you please bring Mr. Daniel's work to my office? Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Maybe we should. And then they feel GT. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, Mr. Dennis, for coming. So our problem here is Jake has been threatening another student here in school. Is that right, Jake? Yes. So, you know, it's a bully free zone here in school. And Jake seems to be acting like a bully. What do you have to say, Jake? Nothing. What's your problem? What are you gonna do about it? You know, I see that you have problems at home. You don't gotta take it out on me. You can take it out on anybody I want. You know what? Stop playing the victim. You're a senior. You're graduating in like 50 days. Grow up. 